we just want to go and look for something that is presence, presence of God. God. I'm Alleluia. The presence of God. Praise, Praise the Lord. When I was to when you talk about the presence of God, you are talking about being in the face of God. You are talking about being in the favor, acceptance of God. You are talking about being in, abiding in, with the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. endure. Big with God will endure big with you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And when you abide in God, you abide in His presence or in His face or in His favor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So when you're talking about being in the presence, or when you talk about the presence in totality or in general, you're talking about being a neighbor to a neighbor who has authority over you. Maybe at the royal rank, Maybe he has a royal rank. Maybe the race here or family plan. Don't be a person or a king. And you're closer to him. Now to Anakwepo is an actual person. If that person is there, come up with me. Sio kibuli. Come up with me. Sio chamutu. He is not a child. Mtu mwenyewe Anakwepo. He's an actual person. Unasema niko mbele ya plan. Yeah, I am before something. I'm in the presence of the president. I'm in his presence. Praise the Lord. When the person is actually present, and if you are present together him in his presence. Mtu anapokuwa kwa uhalisia yuko hapo na wewe uko hapo katika uwepo wake. Yes. Kwa hiyo tunaposema tuko katika uwepo wa Mungu. So when we say we in the presence of the Lord, we the presence of God. Ina maana sisi tulio wadogo. It means we the little guys tuko katika tuko tuko kwenye kibali cha Mungu. We in the favor of God. Tuko usoni kwa Mungu. In the face of God. Na tuko karibu naye closer to him na yeye mungu mwenyewe and he himself yuko mwenye nasi he is with us that's why we abide in his presence but we talk about his presence sio kutisubia we are not talking about who is he he is not in the presence of God no it's a fearsome awesome presence ni uwebo wa kustajabisha na wakutisha na kwa na sama mungu yuko katika tieto which we say God is with us na kwa yu tuko katika uwebo wake and so we are in his presence tuko usoni wake we are before his presence ana kuangalia he is watching over us ana kutasema nae and we speak to him ana tujibu kama tunabio he respond and as we speak kwa yu to the rest so when I see my, I go to see. We honor, we respect. And as far we are before, we are before. And we are close. And he is concerned. So he came to be with us. So being in the presence of God, we say it's an awesome because he actually. He is present. You can't deny the fact that God is present. We talk about the presence of God. We talk about the presence of God. The presence of God is nothing to do with feelings. Because that's what we're going to be talking about. The presence of God is nothing to do with feelings. Because that's what we're going to be talking about. And because people love feelings, they cannot experience the presence of God. Because people love feelings, they cannot experience the presence of God. Because people love feelings, they cannot experience the presence of God. Yes. It is a natural gift for us to be in this place much more us like being a man as like right now. Say a name. So come back to the purpose of plan. It's not like this that God is going to be here. 
tunakosea tunaposema leo uwepo wa Mungu ulikuwa mwingi sana you know we come in an era when we say today there was baada ya kusema kwa kweli leo nyimbo zilikuepo na nikasisimuka sana instead of you be saying the songs were so nice and i got up na leo kutoka nje nisisimuko kukaisha and after i got out of the church that way you can kama unavyoona so you went and did and how was you how was you na kwenye uwepo wake was you no longer the presence lakini yeye anayeliana but he who said that kwamba yupo katika uwepo wa Mungu masaa 24 that is in the presence of God for you mungu yupo pamoja naye god is with him na uwepo wake saa zote anamwangalia all the time Hallelujah. <laughs> And so he said he put his no, he with his guards. You know people who just touch him and say you have no good money. You don't have courage to make a fool of me. How can you do something like that? Say my name. Say my name. Jamaa mmoja jidai sana kumzoea mkuu. You know there was this person that he got you so familiar with. Kwa hiyo akamsalimia na yule mkuu akagaya akasalimia. Na ndio jamaa kwa kutokujua. Eh and not like me friends that are good. So how to see me like that. Ndio ana mkono wangu kuna rusho. So he said you are such a lord of king of my heart and they cover him. Nafikiri aliwekwa mahali pake alijua hapa. And I'm sure so my he knew that this is not the guy that I'm going to call. You hope that it's a web of reality. Because it's an actual presence. It's in the presence of a great person. Say amen. Somebody pray. Bana sifiwe. Pray. Moses and John ni mani ya kuwa katika webo. So Moses knew how to be. He had to put on a nail when he was in the jamo. The presence because he meant to check it in a walk of moto. In the bush that profile. You're sure. You're sure man. You sure knew the meaning. I don't put that jamo down. You don't know where to be. When he got the commander of the army. Abraham. 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 Abraham and he said this is like the end of the summer and that's what we see on the path and we see we see the eyes of the sun and we see the eyes of the sun and we see the eyes of the sun give a lash to be given as a sacrifice so being in the presence the realization of the person is the person who is the person so being in the presence is realized you may be in the presence of somebody who is not aware that you are present that's why maybe with somebody prophesying about you someone may be here and he is not aware one has realized that I am I will have my hand. God will use my hand. Another will look at my hand. He is not aware that he is in the presence of God. God will not use him. He is waiting at you. He is going to be transformed. Praise the Lord. So being in the presence of God. It is to be where God is. 
Sema amen. Amen. Mwambie jeneri kwepo katika uwepo wa Mungu. Then you never be in the presence of God. Kwepo hapa ambapo Mungu yupo. He is being where I can get up to the Ghana. Mungu wa John. Wakati Yesu Kristo alipokuwa kiombe kwa kufuata hela na funzo wake. At the time when Jesus was praying, kama hapo kondoka kulipofika. When the time came when he goes saying Matthew 17 and verse 14 that may be my presence everywhere that I be now that they may be everywhere you are that I may also be that's it in the presence of God hallelujah everywhere that I be I want them to be Kila watakapokuwa where the shall sleep. Kila watakapokuwa melala where the shall sleep. Kila watakapokuwa na tembea au na kula. Where the shall be walk. I want to be there too. Jana ni pale kari sana baadhi na kwa nesho. Yes, I was meditating on Sunday. Kwa jeshi ni tapa cha Yohana kumi. Yeye ni tapa cha Yohana chote. The the whole book of John. Jopo kuzali yopati hata kwa kwa. Say this is what. And I was meditating concerning the word of Christ. I mean, Christ speaks with us everywhere. Walk before His face and His presence every day. Or oh, usually something that is not possible. That is not as you make it impossible. He has already made it to be possible. That thing that you get, wherever I'll be, now I want them to be there. It's not your decision. It's not somebody else's decision. It is his position. And he said, Look that you get. Want them wherever they are. Want them to be. Even office. I'm there. When they are eating. I'm right there. When they're in the restaurant. I'm there. When they're born in the name. Let's not the world. 
I just want them to be where I am.